Welcome to the demonstration of SmartView for Microsoft Office. I am logged into NetSuite Planning and Budgeting. I'll start by clicking the Financials tile and opening my Income Statement Report. In the top right corner of the report, there is an Actions button. I'll click the drop-down and select the Open in SmartView option, which will convert the data into Excel. From Excel, I can access the same data directly from SmartView through my library. Microsoft Excel will automatically open with a selected report. Notice a planning option will appear in the top ribbon. This means this Excel sheet is connected to the NetSuite Planning and Budgeting database. Now I want to retrieve next fiscal year budget data for each department within my organization. In order to toggle my dimensions, I will have to select ad hoc analysis. I can find this under the Excel planning ribbon. I'll click analyze. You might notice that the original blue and gray format disappeared. This is because I previously set my SmartView formatting default options to use Excel formatting instead of use cell styles. Also, the point of view box appears with our dimensions. I can drag this box and pin it to the toolbar or bring each individual dimension into the grid. In this case, I want my full year budget. That's under my scenario dimension. The report defaults to actual and budget scenario. I'll update the first column value from actual to budget and go to my planning ad hoc ribbon and select the keep only feature. This will preserve only the selected columns and remove the rest of the columns with data. This is a shortcut option to removing data versus selecting the unwanted columns in Excel and deleting them. Next, I want to bring my department dimensions to the grid. I can simply drag it or insert a new column and type total department in the new intersection. I'll click refresh. Notice the department dimensions box disappears from the ribbon. To bring in all my departments, I will use the zoom in feature under planning ad hoc on my tool ribbon. Here, I will bring over my entire department dimension hierarchy by clicking the arrow drop down option and selecting all levels. All formatting occurs within the front end tools such as Microsoft Excel. So let's go back to the familiar Excel home menu and select as an example, comma style number formatting. If I want to incorporate the report into a PowerPoint presentation, I'll select the data in Excel that I want to see in my presentation. I'll go to SmartView in my ribbon and click copy. Then I'll navigate to the slide in my PowerPoint presentation deck and click on the SmartView option in the ribbon and then paste. I'll hit refresh and can add comments or format if necessary. Thank you for watching this demonstration. If you have any questions, please reach out to your account manager.